Suppose you're driving your car on a highway or even in the middle of the city and you suddenly feel a sudden pain and discomfort in your chest. The pain is like a heavy pressure. One of my patients describe it like a giant elephant sitting on his chest or like extreme tightness and squeezing pain. Most of the time, it's in the middle of the chest, spreading down to the left arm. The pain could last more than a few minutes. You might also be having difficulty breathing, feeling faint with a cold sweat. These symptoms could be the early signs of unstable angina or a heart attack. So what should you do next? Welcome back to another video. My name is Dr. Amir. The first thing you should do is definitely not to continue driving to the nearest hospital, but you should stop your car as soon as possible in a safe area and call the paramedics to send you an ambulance after giving them your location. Of course, these symptoms could also be related to a panic attack, but you don't want to take any chances. You should be evaluated and treated in the emergency room. We normally can confirm the diagnosis of a heart attack by doing an urgent heart racing or ECG and a blood test to check for elevated heart enzyme called troponin. If you are having a heart attack, you only have six to eight hours from the onset of chest pain to receive a medicine in the vein called the clot buster or to have an urgent procedure called heart catheterization in order to dilate and open the blocked artery in the heart and place a stent to avoid a permanent damage to the heart. Another reason to be in the hospital if you suspect having a heart attack, is the risk of developing a dangerous abnormal heart rhythm. This can cause your heartbeat to go fast over 150 beats per minute. Here, the heart is not able to pump blood to your body, especially the brain, causing loss of consciousness and cardiac arrest. This is a very serious and could be deadly condition. This is the reason why you should not be driving at that time. The most effective way to reverse and treat this abnormal rhythm is to deliver a shock by a machine called defibrillator as soon as possible. The more time we delay the delivering of the shock, the less likely you survive the heart attack. So what is a heart attack? Heart attack occur when the blood flow to one of the small arteries in the heart get blocked, causing a damage in the heart muscles. This process does not happen overnight, but it will take years to develop. Here is my advice if you suspect having a heart attack. First of all, timing is very important. You or someone needs to call and get an ambulance to take you to the hospital as soon as possible. Second, try not to panic, as anxiety can make it worse. Third, if you have a baby aspirin, chew one immediately. For patients who already have angina, they know that they need to take nitroglycerin pill under the tongue to relieve the chest pain. Finally, to prevent this condition, you should avoid or treat all the illnesses which are the risk factors to develop a heart attack. And I will talk about the healthy heart in a future video. I hope you enjoyed my video today. If you did, please hit the like and subscribe buttons. And until I see you again, please drive safe and have a happy, healthy life.